Black Ops, you see it. Let's get it. Ace Hold Hardware Store Empire failed by cyber attack. U.S. Outfitter scrambles to repair operations, restoring process of online orders. <laughs> Ace Hardware is getting hacked. Come on now. Let's read a super quick article. Ace Hardware appears to have been the latest organization to succumb to a cyber attack. Judging by the website and the message from CEO John Van Hoosen, the site today warns that the retailer-owned cooperative is unable to process online orders. A member from Buhaisen indicate the problem is serious. In a note sent to Ace retailers this week, on Sunday morning, we detected a cybersecurity incident that is impacting the majority of our IT systems. As a result of this incident, many of our key operating systems, including AceNet, our warehouse management system, the Ace Retailer Mobile Assistant, Hot Sheets, Invoices, Ace Rewards, and the Care Center phone systems have been interrupted or suspended. Man, their whole operation is down. But once again, we got a lot of videos. Incident response should be in there. You should be able to uh, do a DR and fail over, or at least be able to run your minimal operations with paper, right? So if you're going to be hit, what are you going to do when you're under cyber attack or ransomware attack? How are you going to run your operations? Some of that should be paper. Some of that should be some uh, old style systems that you can bring up that's not part of your network. But those are some of the things you need to work out an incident response in. How are you going to handle it? At the time of the writing, ACE has not responded to the registry request for further information. Judging by the commentary on social media, things are not going well inside. A uh, net citizen claimed to, uh, to work at a multi-billion dollar org warehouse have reported being sent home and others fear they won't be able to, they won't be paid on time. So that's one of the big deal that happened with Kronos. Your pay system down, you got to pay your employees or they're going to find other work, right? So that's one of the things is if you get hit, how are you going to pay your employees? The most recent update seen by the registration warrant that no deliverables will no deliverables will be made today, October the 31st, and that Ace Hardware is unable to receive orders from its retailers. Those stores should, however, remain open, and organizations noted that was no known impact to either in-store payment systems or credit card processing. So obviously those are on separate networks, so in-store payment systems and credit cards are working. In other words, it appears you can buy stuff in stock from an Ace shop in person, but if you need to use Ace Corporate or a place in order to use some other services, you will be out of luck. Ace Hardware has yet to clarify the type of attack that it suffered, only that it's working to restore systems and operation and has had to call in some digital forensic experts to help out. Your Ace team, along with the supportive group of technical forensic expert, is working feverishly <laughs> to resolve the situation. The CEO added to his retailer, Nothing is more important than restoring all our operations as seen uh, as humanly possible. We're dealing with a fast moving dynamic situation. Details will be changing rapidly. The whole bunch of vulnerabilities out there that could have been exploited to take down our org's IT. Switches users were urged to patch a critical net scaler uh, bug last week, noted from MGM uh, cyber attack in September. Ace Hardware Corporation is described as the world's largest retail on hardware cooperative. It's headquartered in Illinois, USA. The biz sells tools and other things you need for DIY. It says it has more than 5,000 stores worldwide, most of which are independently owned and operated. The company's seen a decrease in revenue recently and reported $2.1 billion for the first quarter in 2023 a decrease of 5.8% compared to the same time the previous year. Wow, I guess I didn't know um, Ace Hardware was doing $2.1 billion. That's for the first quarter. That's not even a whole year. It also ranked as the sixth most trusted retailer in the United States, according to Newsweek, most trusted uh, companies in America. So once again, <laughs> Ace Hardware, Ace Hold Hardware Store Empire failed by cyber attacks. United States outfit scrambles to re repair operation and restore processing of online orders. So once again, everybody can get it. <laughs> Come on, Ace Hardware.
Professor Black Ops, please subscribe. We got to work on that cybersecurity. We got to work on that cybersecurity.